Hey everybody, Ricky Adam Handicapping, thoroughbred racing from my hometown track, Penn National Racecourse, Grandfield, Pennsylvania, on Thursday evening, February the 2nd. And this is my dayatthetrack.com race of the day. Let's take a look at race 5 tonight, folks. 7.38 p.m. Eastern Post Time. 8.5 furlong route test on the dirt track. 4-year-olds and up racing for some $32,000. Contenders number five, Battleground, number one, Coffee Bar, number four, Duke's Alley, and number two, Grand Macho. Number five, Battleground, has hit the board in each of his last five with three of those efforts, including a win in his second race back, also qualifying as power runs. Jockey Dana Whitney and trainer Tim Kreiser send him postward. They've hit the board with 63% of their entry saddle as a team to date. Number one, Coffee Bar has hit the board in three of his last four, with two of those efforts also qualifying as power runs. Race five summary, number five, Battleground. Tops my contenders list tonight here at Penn Nat, which also includes number one, Coffee Bar, number four, Duke's Alley, and number two, Grand Macho, 5142 in the fifth from Penn National. Bonus long shots, Charlestown, race eight, entry number three, Star Kicker. A 12 to 1 bomb takes a nine level class drop. It's the overall speed leader in its allowance field, racing at or about today's distance of eight and one half furlongs on the dirt. Back here at Penn National, race six, entry number seven, New Revolution, eight to one on the morning line, qualifies as a Trackmaster Plus Power Pony, takes a slight class drop into the overall speed leader in this claiming field tonight, racing at the mile distance on the dirt. So from Penn National on a Thursday night, Rick Needham for dayatthetrack.com, reminding you as always to please bet with your head, not over it.